There was one student in my classroom this year that I think is a perfect example of why it's important to engage families from the beginning of the school year. This student, um, Jay, is a student I taught third grade this year and is known throughout the school um, just for his negative choices. Um, he's not many people are not very fond of him, unfortunately. So from the beginning of the school year, I actually sat down with both parents, and his parents are separated, but he has an awesome mom and an awesome dad. Um, and I sat down with both of them and kind of talked to them about their experiences in the past and what they wanted moving forward this year. And both of them were kind of at a point of like, we, we just want to get through the year. Anytime you, know, you, need, him, you need us to come pick him up, we can come pick him up because in the past it's kind of been he generally has gone home at least once a week from school but oftentimes more than that just picked up in the middle of the day for various um, reasons and I told them point blank at the beginning of the year that that just was not going to be the experience but I wanted him in the classroom learning at all times he wasn't going to be taken out of the classroom because in order to learn, he needed to be with me. So we kind of talked about what their actual academic goals were for their student and talked about how he was gonna grow a lot during the school year and we were also gonna make sure that we address his behavioral needs so that he could make that academic growth. It was really, really important to get their input on making his behavioral goals in particular because they really knew what worked best with Jay at home and how we could work together to make sure that he got those needs met in the classroom. Um, one of the specific strategies that I worked with him on was actually taking, before he got to a melting point, um, taking a break and he had specific breaks that he could take and we constructed those as mom, dad, and Jay together and that way we were all comfortable with them. We all knew what he was doing in the day and I was able to tell them specifically whether or not he was achieving his goals or not. Likewise, it was really exciting for Jay to have his parents involved because he just, I mean, he has great parents and, and he loves them, but um, he knew that if he wasn't meeting his goals, they were gonna be really disappointed in him. And that if he did meet them, they were gonna be really excited for him and be really proud of him. One of the most um, important moments of success this year with Jay was um, he did actually surpass his math goals of growth for the school year. And so after taking, immediately after taking the assessment and finding out his results, we called both his mom and his dad and shared the results of his test and, and the fact that he had met his goals because of all the hard work that as a family they'd put in together and specifically the hard work that had put in in my classroom. So it was really exciting because Jay was so proud of himself and his parents were so excited to hear how well he had done. And they knew that his success was a direct result of the fact that we all advocated together for his success in the classroom.